I had a colleague that prescribed ivermectin to a patient, and it was prescribed based on weight. The patient, without the doctor's knowledge, then gave ivermectin to a sibling. The sibling took the ivermectin, don't know how it was taken, whether it was taken as prescribed in the bottle or just taken, but that brother, who was a brother of the patient, was not evaluated. So you know, no knowledge was uh, known of that patient's metabolism, that is the liver detoxification, other medications the patient was taking, supplements, you get what I'm talking about. And so that patient ended up in the ER in a coma two days later, but of course they took the patient off the ivermectin, but two days later the patient woke up, rare but real. Now, what I'm talking about here is the neurological side effects, the neurotoxicity potential of ivermectin, very rare. Most people will look at ivermectin and say, well, it can cause hypotension, GI side effects, and skin rashes, and, and that's going to be mostly what you see. But here, the neurotoxicity are things like ataxia, which is loss of coordination, slurred speech, fine motor skill disruption, and then dizziness, confusion, seizures, and coma.